Hey Alex, you spoke with Courtney earlier today and she wanted to give you a video showing what you can do to increase the customers you got going on in your business. And my name is Sean and I'm going to help you out. So what we're going to go over are those three things and I just want to let you know before we start, this is stuff that you can do all yourself. You don't actually need a marketing team to do any of this. The reason why we're here is because we offer a service much like you. Anybody can do plumbing, but most people don't want to do it. So same thing with marketing. Anybody can do it, but most people don't want to. And that's what we're here for. All we're looking for is at the end of this video is getting some feedback on what you think of the material. And that's it. So if you could do that for us, we'd very much appreciate it. All right. Now, without further ado, we can go ahead and jump right in. So the number one thing that you need to do to, in order to rank is make sure you've got content. Content is king. So you need to have at least 1,500 words of content in order to rank in Google, uh, depending on the competition, of course. Sometimes it's a little less, sometimes it's a little more, uh, sometimes it's substantially more. But usually it's about 1,500, and you need good quality keywords, which all a keyword is is a phrase that someone's searching for in Google to help uh, find the business that they're looking for. So I've got one of those pulled up here, Plumber in Las Vegas, Nevada. But before we jump there, I want to point this out to you. Your website is not secure. In order to get it secure, all you need to do is get with the registrar wherever you got your domain and get an SSL. If you don't do this, you're going to have a hard time ranking. Google does not like unsecure websites ranking. So without further ado, we'll keep going. All right. Plumbers in Las Vegas, Nevada. So you got ads up at the top, of course. Then you've got the Google Map Pack here. So in order to get to the top of the Google Map Pack, you need to have citations. You need to have a lot of citations. What's a citation, you ask? Citation is the name of your company, address, and phone number being listed in directories. You need to continue to add this information into multiple directories every week, every month, every year. So Google knows that you're still relevant and still in business. You keep doing this and eventually you'll move, work your way up. Uh, a couple other factors uh, is the ratings here. The more ratings you get, the better. You can entice your customers to rate things for you. Maybe offer them a little discount. That will help them put this in because this will help drive more business to you. Uh, another major factor in ranking in the map pack is ranking organically. And in order to rank organically, you need to have the content, the keywords, and then the backlinks. So we'll get to the backlinks here in a second. But before we get there, I just want to show you what you're competing against. So the top page here is Larkin Plumbing. And, uh, you know, they have more content. Likely why they're beating you out, but they might have more backlinks as well. So we'll go ahead and skip on over that to here. So we got you guys pulled up. This is a tool called Arifs. What Arifs is, is just a uh, tool that allows us to look into the backlinking, into the other things that you've got on your website that are helping you be where you're at. So right now it's looking like you're getting 18 people per month. You got 48 backlinks. So you might ask, what's a backlink? A backlink is a link from one website to another. So you got um, somebody writing a blog saying you guys are doing an amazing job and they leave a link to the, your website on theirs. That'd be a backlink. The referring domain is the website that that blog is sitting on. So not all uh, backlinks are the same. If you've got a link from Forbes magazine article saying that you guys are the best company in the world, you're going to get significantly more power from that than you would a blog. So these are the trust and power ratings that Google gives you guys based on all this information. So this is out of 100, 18 out of 100 and 1.1 out of 100. 18's okay, one's not great. Uh, and of course, with that rating increasing, you will end up moving further up the ranks in organic. All right, so we got your competition here. You can see that they're a little bit higher here. They've got significantly more backlinks and uh, you can tell it's, it's making them more money, right? They're getting an extra thousand people in a month. So these things will make an impact on your business. So I really hope, Alex, that you, you uh, take some of this advice because it will help you out. And you'll be making your own, um, your own leads so you won't have to pay Angie any more money for all her leads because I know she's pretty expensive. You can do this all yourself. All right, so with that, we'll go ahead and recap. 
1,500 words or more. Make sure you got good quality keywords or phrases in there. Add citations to all the different directories and continue to do that. And then number three is add backlinks. Add a lot of backlinks and make sure you're getting quality backlinks from good websites. All right, Alex, if you don't mind just giving us some feedback on this video, we'd really appreciate it. You can give us a call back at 505-871-4338, and Courtney would be happy to talk to you. All right, sir, you have a wonderful day, and we'll talk soon.